Minute. My phone is dying, so I might not have too much footage for you tonight. I'm going to try to see what I could get. They usually have a, um, a charger at the bar, but I see how lucky I get. Anyway, um, what was I going to say? Give it to heart. It saved my ass this morning. Like, literally, no pun intended. She <laughs> really saved my ass. But I got to tell you how later on. So look forward to that. Okay, I'm one block away. I knew. I was like, there's no way. I thought I was there, but it was like, uh-uh. That can't be it. Anyway, one of my dream places to live, actually, was Harlem. When I was coming up and I used to come to visit. And I learned about Malcolm X and Billy Holiday living here. And uh, not Frederick Douglass. So was the other one. Langston Hughes and, you know, all these wonderful gurus that lived in Harlem. Like, I was just so fascinated with Harlem. And I said I always wanted to have a brownstone and a studio in the basement. <laughs> but I never ended up in Harlem. I ended up in Inglewood. But I love Jersey. I do. I don't know if I'll be in Jersey forever. But I do want to have a house in a few places one day. And rent them out and get that money. Like, I'm not just going to... You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm trying to stack money. I'm all about generational wealth. Mm -hmm. I swear to you this little bird is following me. Anyway, oh, I see the crew. <laughs> I'm about to be at the lounge. Hold up. Let me see. It's been a minute. I'll come back.